Hi guys, welcome to our 80s life where we're all about the 80s. I'm Abby and I am addicted to caboodles. I had several of them when I was younger, back in the 80s and early 90s. In fact, here's a picture from my college dorm room and you can see my caboodles in the picture. Sadly, I don't have those older caboodles anymore, but recently I came across a bit of a vintage caboodles haul, which I am excited to share with you guys. You guys might remember, I bought some brand new caboodles and did a caboodles haul video of those, which I will link below. And I totally love that they're making the old style in the new caboodles. But there is nothing like a vintage one, the ones that were really made in the 80s and 90s. So I'm always on the hunt for those older ones. And you guys, a couple weeks ago, I was at the Goodwill store and I hadn't found anything good. And I was just about to give up and I turned the corner and I saw three vintage caboodles and they are beautiful they're in perfect condition i cannot wait to show you guys first though you might remember i already had two vintage caboodles that i had bought at a state sale so i have this black and white one and the purple and sort of gray one and these are the on the go girl cases this one's really cool because it still has its original sticker I've shown these to you guys in the estate sale haul videos when I show you what I got each month. But I thought I should make a special video today because I found three of them in one shopping trip at one Goodwill store. I'm assuming they might be all from the same owner because since they were all together and they're all in perfect condition. So I could not be happier to get these and I can't wait to show them to you. First up is this also on the go girl. So here's my black and white one. Here's on the go girl in it's kind of a marble, marbleized hot pink. Very pretty. It's got a purple handle. Look at that. The original logo still looks really nice. And inside, of course, it has the mirror and it has the tray and the removable tray. So this comes out and you can put other things like lipsticks and stuff underneath where it's got the sections. So everything is here, it's complete and it is in excellent condition. And so that's the first one. One way you can tell if you're wondering how to know if it's a vintage one, let me show you something. Do you see the newer ones? They have all plastic construction on this piece, the, the little thing that opens it. See how that's just plastic right there? And here as well on the top, you see it's all plastic in the handle. Okay, the older ones, the vintage ones, they have a metal ring. See it? This part is metal. The closure is similar, but it has this ring that wraps around and then you snap it. I love that sound. Um, and then on the top, look at the handles. See those two little metal pieces right here, little metal grommets? The new ones don't have those. So right away, those are some ways that when I see these out and about, I can know, okay, that's a vintage one. And usually I don't know exactly the year. I'm still trying to figure out how to date these. But one of the ones I bought had a date on it, which I'll show you in a minute. Okay, the second one is this. It's similar to the other one. It's also marble, marbleized. Um, it's more of a cotton candy pink, and I love this color. The handle is also pink, a bit darker of a pink. And it, as you see, like I just showed you, it also has the metal band right here for the closure. And it has the telltale metal grommets on the top. Um, but this one is bigger than the on-the-go case. This is the two-tiered large case. It's 
sometimes they call them a train case. So check this out. The inside is white, which is so cute. Okay, you open it like this and it has two trays, two tier trays. So that's a little bit different. It's a little bit bigger than the on the go girl one. And so this is the, I think they call it the large or the, it might be XL. It's the biggest one and also in excellent condition, like perfect, perfect condition. I mean, it was used, but it just was even clean on the inside. I clean them all as soon as I get them. I have a separate video that I showed you how I clean these things. When I get them in the door, I always clean them right away so I can, you know, start using them and enjoying them, but they really were not very dirty at all. Okay, are you ready for this? I cannot wait to show you my favorite find from this little caboodles haul. Check out this one. Oh my goodness. So right away I got really excited. I've never actually seen one of these with the caboodles letters embellished on there. I love that. I know they also come with polka dots. This is not the polka dot one. This one has the, the lettering that spells out caboodles. So already I'm like blown away by it. It's in just perfect minty condition. But look at this, you guys. See that? This one is actually dated. Plano, which is the company that makes these, 1990. So now that we know that this one was for sure made in 1990, I think it's a safe assumption that this one was also made in 90 because it has the exact same construction, just in a different color. And I think they all three came from the same owner. So I'm gonna guess that they were all made in about 1990. But look at this, you guys. It has a reddish handle, white on the bottom. Here's the logo there. Here's the top, so pretty. This is my favorite one. Here's the metal closure, which works perfectly still. You hear that snap? And then inside, I mean, it is like brand new in there. It's mint condition. It's got the mirror and the two tiered tray like the other one. And I, I just love this. And look how much it could hold. Like you could put a ton of stuff in here. It even has the Caboodles logo there on the inside as well. And the other one had that too, which I thought was cool. I forgot to point it out to you. Whoop, there we go. All right, snap it closed. And away we go. Wow, 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 wow.